The genre film is more about production style, not substance. Since 21st century, more Chinese filmmakers have devoted themselves to China's brilliant past. More specifically, they have recreated some of China's epic battles on the big screen. In the process, the war epic has become quintessential Chinese genre film, complete with its own rules. Today, Real Talk presents the nitty-gritty of war movies with the cinematic battle royale. 听说，他除了成了绝代佳人，嫁给周瑜了。I think that part is a little bit problematic because um, Jiang was sort of hanged. The whole war started because of a woman, Xiao Qiao, and and I think that theme mm, might not match um, the expectation of the Chinese audience. Because Chinese audience, they think they always think of like some grandier theme like you fight for the country or you want the overall peace and, and like among the all, all the countries but I think for the Western audience they will love more of that because the heroic romantic um, relationship um, they will love that kind of um, surprises <laughs> Um, uh, Zhou Yu's wife is going to give birth to a baby and which is a horse giving birth to a little baby and it's like oh, wow I didn't really expect that it's very funny not only Chinese audience but also Western audience because they can really get the jokes and it connects the people first when I saw the movie for my first time I didn't really like uh, Zhu Ge Liang played by Jin Chen Wu um, because it's totally out of my expectation. But later when I watch it again and again, I think at least it gives people surprises. And I think surprises are what the audience, like, what push the audience to go to watch the movie. Because they want to see a whole different interpretation of the character. Although sometimes I still don't like um, the, play, the character played by Ling Zhuling. Because I think it just like, <laughs> she didn't contribute a lot <laughs> in terms of the movie, um, what's the story, the story um, like the plot line and how it develops.